everybody. Thanks for checking out the beat of a different drummer where we talk about all things percussion. And today I want to do a cover of The Ocean, a Led Zeppelin tune off of the Houses of the Holy. And of course, this is John Bonham on drums, uh, probably one of the best rock drummers. Uh, some people would say the best of all time. And uh, I'm not going to get into that because that's all opinion, very subjective. Uh, you can have it out on YouTube comment pages with that if you want. But this is one of my favorite Zeppelin tunes. I mean, I listened to Zeppelin a lot as a kid. I think I got into Led Zeppelin for the Untitled, the Symbols album, Zoso, whatever you want to call it. It's the one with Stairway on it. And I can remember listening to, to Black Dog and trying to figure out that turnaround on that and, and just how cool that tune was and uh, playing along with Misty Mountain Hop and... And that type of drumming language does kind of soak into your blood after a while. And uh, it wasn't until later that I learned that John Bonham actually had a, a swing background. He listened to swing and jazz records when he was younger. And that influenced his playing quite a bit. If you go listen to some of the drums-only takes that they have online of uh, John Bonham playing, it's an astounding feel. I mean, though the sound that you hear on those recordings, that's why he is known as one of the best drummers ever. Uh, and it's his sound, and it's his feel. And with that feel, there is a little bit of swing in the eighth, uh, the eighth notes that he plays in some of his fills. If you if you go into uh, there are many recordings that. Uh, he'd made where his fills have a little bit of swing on them. And by that, I mean that it's not just, it's not a straight eighth feel on a fill like this. There might be a little bit of a swing to it. Now that's a lot right there, but just to demonstrate the difference, and you, you'll feel it or hear it in... Uh, all over the place, but not all the time. It just depends on what he was feeling and what he wanted in a particular spot. So I think that is is part of the greatness of John Bonham. And also, it, it took three other band members to lock in with that and create the Zeppelin sound. So this particular tune, The Ocean, is one of my favorites because it's got some just particular little uh, little things. I'm not going to call them mistakes because they're, they're things that I love about this tune. But uh, the first one is the count in at the beginning. I think it's uh, John Paul Jones who counts it in. And uh, I can remember listening to that in my basement and, and going, oh, there's a, there's a count off here. And then you listen to it and it's kind of a funny count off too. And then there is a, uh, a phone, a telephone, that rings in the studio while they're recording the tune and they just keep going. It's somewhere in the middle. I don't have the exact uh, number for it. So just a, a couple things about this recording that make it one of my favorites. So uh, this is uh, my cover of The Ocean by Led Zeppelin from The Houses of the Holy. Thanks for watching and I hope you enjoy it.